Welcome back to Casminicus, everybody. So we're in a new world. We're looking for a certain weapon here. We're looking for the ocarina. The forest ocarina. So that means we gotta go to the jungle. And we gotta look through jungle chests there. We can look through the uh, tree. The li Is it called living with trees? Living with trees down there? Is that what they're called? Or are they just called mahogany? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, we're looking for those trees in the jungle. And we're looking for just jungle shrines. Because those are both areas where we can get the uh, stuff, the ocarina from. So let's go find that. What the fuck? I've never seen like a bunch of rocks just chilling in the desert. The heck? <laughs> That's a first time, first time for everything. You know what they say? Jungle wasn't on the right side. I should have known that. I, I kept on going even after. Is it? Can the jungle be on the same side of the snow bomb? I don't know. I just kept on going even after I saw the snow bomb. Worms? I need worms. I don't have my net. Never mind. You can, you can stay. You can stay. Little wormy. Does this? Will this lead me into the jungle? This will not lead me into the jungle. All right. Good to know. Someone told me to place a uh, music box in the this biome uh, because the music is annoying to them. I'm, I'm gonna have to hit you with a whole hearty no for now. Oh fuck. Yo, I never see goddamn desert temples anymore. You know how rare this is? Blow the fuck into this. Where's the entrance? I want a flying carpet. You know how dope a flying carpet would be? There better, be better not be no new loot that can overwrite this. This is exciting, dude. I've barely seen desert temples. <gasps> we got a flying carpet. Exactly what I wanted in my life. Yes! Alright, hopefully it doesn't take too long to find a chest. This does not count. I'm pretty sure these chests don't count. But might as well get the loot anyways. Alright. Come on. There's no, like, platform? That's weird. There's usually always platforms at the bottom. Alright, maybe not always. But there usually is. Excuse me, don't fucking touch me like that. No consent. I'm gonna have to report that one. Call that one in. I work, uh, I work with uh, consent services. It's like a child protection services, but it's only for consenting. Excuse me. Mudman. Mudmen are so useless. They don't drop anything. Like, they used to drop that stuff to get the druid to spawn in. But now they're just kind of there. Jungle shrine. This is it right here. This is it right here. Maraca that bitch. Oh my god. My health bar. Okay. Let me see it. Let me get that water to flood through, though. All right. Boom. Forest Ocarina. There we go. We done got it. It whistles out a wild burst of noise. Right-clicking. Right-click to summon a forest sigil, which mimics your ocarina. Bringing forth the sigil costs five inspiration. All right. Do it. Ooh. I like it. And then we can get that shit to home like this. Get that motherfucker. Hold on, I don't have any inspiration. Now, get that motherfucker. Ooh, that's pretty dope. All right, here we are back at home. Let's reforge this. But then it's like, hold up. Where's my goblin? He ain't here. Oh, shit. What is that? Is that a cello? We got a good old cello chilling over here. Cello chilling over here. I like it. Peep this. I made this during a stream. Pretty, pretty nice looking. I had some troubles with some things here and there, like rooms and stuff. Because ropes don't count as. Ooh, that's really good. Ropes don't count as a, like, wall. I guess that makes sense. This is kind of something that separates rooms. So these are only all one rooms. This one. This one is two rooms. This one is one room. This is one room. This is one room. It's fine. Sucks that it couldn't be two rooms, but it's fine. It's perfectly fine. What what kind of what kind of contracts do you got? Pinky Nymph Tim. I don't think I'm ever gonna kill Tim again, but it's fine. So who's next on this boss list? We got the Ghastly Ent. I don't remember how this guy spawns in. I'll be 100% honest. Something about being in the forest biome. Something like that. But uh, let's make that ember weave armor. I've been wanting to make that for a while now. The ember weave, or it's not called ember weave. It's called like balladeer set or something like that. Let's just see. 
Let's just see if we can make it. No, it's Noble Set. Not Balladeer. There's an arm set, I think, in the future called Balladeer. So we just need more Ember Weave. I don't remember even how to craft it. It's like Hellstone and Cloth. I think I ran out of Cloth. So let's get more Cloth. That's not the right place. Cloth. There we go. Get like 40. 40 should be good. Why do I keep opening this? Ember. Let's not overcraft what we need. And then what I make? I made the hat. There's a pants. Or there's a chest. How much are the pants? Noble. The pants are 16. Okay, we should be good then. We should be good. Ember, we have 16. So just one more. Boom. And we got the new Noble set. Ready for business. Ready and open for business. I don't know what I don't know what the fuck is open, but is it, the noble set is temp yeah, you can read all this. It's better. So boom, that should put our defense up to 39. It's pretty good. With the, the other gesture set in there. Alright, so not only that, but let's get the I think the cork. Okay, and let's get the microphone out now the microphone is in a ton of recipes and we'll, we'll we'll talk about the cork first now the cork we can make the bard kit which is like the yo-yo kit or the yo-yo bag whatever you want to call it this i feel like i really need to make we need a high quality reed which i think i've been able to craft that for the longest time i just haven't high quality reed i think it's made out of wood dynasty wood at a sawmill we have a dry a druid a dryad we need to talk to the Dryad. Dryad should be selling some new. And this is how we're gonna get Dynasty Wood. Very sorry, I didn't mean to summon that. Does she sell it? I don't think she sells it. Is it the Druid? It might be the Druid, actually. How do you get the Druid again? <laughs> you gotta like find, okay. So, I mean, we can just make Dynasty Wood, can't we? Pretty sure we can also just make Dynasty Wood. Timmy the Angler, what a great name. Uh, Dynasty Wood. Can we convert? Tree Gatherer. Are you fucking kidding me? I gotta make a Tree Gatherer? <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Right. Tree Gatherer. Please don't be hard to make. Ooh, look. Tree Swords. Tree Gatherer. Oh my fucking god. Alright, so I just bought like pretty much everything from the Dryad. So we should be able to make a tree. The fuck am I missing? I'm missing a chest, really? Am I really missing a chest? I am. Just a simple wooden chest is what I'm missing. Wait, no. Hold up. I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Sorry. Floral wood chest actually looks pretty cool. Um. Regular. Regular chest. Okay. <laughs> I really don't have the materials required. Just a regular. I guess eight wood, two iron. Or I don't have wood in here. I don't have regular wood in here. I don't even have regular wood in my inventory. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Severus. What a great name. Hey, Severus. I need potions. Is he the one that sells potions? No, it's the other one. Damn it. All right. Why, why this flower break? Do flowers break underwater? God damn it. It's fine. Just give me a, give me a tree, all right? Give me a tree, and then while we're at it, just place some sunflowers. That will help reduce corruption. Which I, I'm in dire need of reducing. Get out of here. Shoot. Get out. I got my new ocarina. Doesn't make any cool noises. Doesn't make any ocarina noises. But it's cool, alright? It's still cool. Alright, so now let's just shove, like... Shove all the wood in there. We don't need wood. Uh, now we should be able to make a chest. Yes. Regular chest. There we go, finally. Now we can make the tree gather. There we go. Gathers wood. Can convert basic wood into other type. And there we go. And now we get the other remaining wood we put in here. If there is any. Yeah, there's 50. And then we turn this into dynasty. I need more coins. Like three, three more silver coins, I think. We just need 10, right? Boom. There's 10. This is a lot of work doing. <laughs> Alright, now we're able to make the fucking cork. That's not what it's called. It's called reed. 
because I have the cork. Okay, I don't. Read. Where do we make it at? Sawmill. The 10 dynasty wood. Dine. I got, I got 10. There is indeed a sawmill, right? Is that not a sawmill? Oh, it's not a sawmill. It's missing the sawmill part. Okay, that's fine. I thought I had a sawmill this whole time. Sawmill. There you go. Let's combine these together real quick. Real quick. Can I, can I just like combine them? No, I got to put them in the chest. Jesus Christ. All right. Saw. No. Workstation. Workshop. No, close enough. Whatever. Now we can type in read. That was a good like seven minutes. I don't know how many minutes. That's a long time we spent doing all that. There we go. Let's combine all this shit together now. Into the what the fuck is it called? Bag? It's not what it's called. We'll just go to filter equipment. <laughs> Already forgot what it's called. I just burped right there. I don't know if you guys. It was like a very silent burp though. There we go. Bard kit. Fucking finally. All right. Now let's get into the microphone. The microphone has a lot of things. Look at this. Sub woofers. A whole lot of subwoofers it can make like crazy amounts and i don't know exactly how good these are but there's a lot of them and maybe we want to have multiple on at once maybe this is a frozen one there's a deep deep dark one blood demon grim this blood demon surprisingly does not use the blood demon stuff uh jungle one damage done it okay let's let's go through the ones we can get <clears throat> like right now like that we can make right now not including these two because we have to go get materials for that same thing in that one we have to get materials i think we can make this one uh there's a traveling merchant your symphonic damage empowers all well obviously damage done against gouged enemies gouge though this yeah gouge enemies is increased by eight percent doubles the range of your empowerment's effect radius Gouged enemies. The fuck is gouged enemies? Is that like the effect that deep dark, deep dark, that uh, the aquatic depths weapons put on things? I think this one. Symphonic damage and powers all been in absolute precision. Okay. These seem like multiplayer things, primarily, but there's a couple of them. Damage done against poison enemies increased by eight percent. Jungles nibble. I like that. <laughs> Then these are is increased by 5%. So I don't think any of these are really going to be useful to us. They do look really cool though. So yeah, you guys are going to have to tell me, are any of those really going to be worth it right now? I don't think any of them are. For now, I kind of want to get rid of the Warding Shield of Cthulhu and trade for the Flying Carpet. Because the Flying Carpet's fucking awesome, that's why. I want to get the Flying car Hello? What was that noise? Give me a warding, please. Can I get a warding on my flying carpet? You're gonna make me spend all my money. There we go. Kinda just wanna like rock the flying carpet, you know what I'm saying? No, after like the wing time is over, we can just flying carpet away. Who the fuck needs a dash? I mean, I'll still keep it though. But who needs a dash? Put it like right there, cause I don't want it in my accessory slot. I don't want it on my character. So I totally forgot that I turned off tree men. So I turned them back on. Tree men being the thing that drops the stuff to summon in the ghastly end. Turn them back on. I think this is what we need. Yeah, ancient log. So there we go. Tree men back. Because I turned them off because they kept on trying to break open my door in David's playthrough. At the dungeon. In the oasis. And I guess like the oasis became their second home because they wouldn't stop spawning there. Same thing with like night slimes or something like that. But let's fight this boss. Let's have some fun with it. Um, let's put. Said the enchanted ring. Let's put the. Whoa, what does this do again? Symphonic empowerments. Critical power. Alright, whatever. Alright, let's just summon in our instruments here. Boom, bada, bing. Instruments have been summoned. I like how they all kind of attack. I'm pretty sure I thought it was just this one that attacked. Yeah, steel drums doesn't 
This one's the one that attacks. Whatever. All right, let's do this ghastly end. I don't think I need a buff for this. It's a fairly early boss. I like its icon on the map. It's a fairly early boss. Let's use our ocarina. And let's do some work on this baby. Let's do some work on this grown man. I shouldn't say baby. That's weird. Hey, grown man. I'm about to do work on you. I'm about to get it. This motherfucker shooting fire? Isn't that hazardous? You're a tree person. Isn't that hazardous? Sir. <laughs> oh, fuck. Where'd he go? Sir, isn't that hazardous? You shouldn't be doing that. Oh, God. He's teleporting everywhere. I barely remember this dude's AI. Whoa. When's he going to stop doing that? Stop doing that. Oh. So this thing doesn't really last that long. Maybe the microphone makes it last longer. Maybe the maybe the music sheet makes it last longer. Let's see. Maybe the music seat sheet makes it last longer. We're gonna see how long it stays there. This dude is kind of hurting me. He is kind of hurting me. No, it doesn't feel like it lasted longer. So we're gonna go back to my flying carpet. My flying carpet of doom. Get on that flying carpet. Hell yeah. Even though it doesn't exactly have 100% use right now. It's a fucking flying carpet. Like, come on. Ah! Alright, we're gonna heal up. Just be safe, we're gonna heal up. I just wanna use this the whole entire fight. Because this weapon is so cool looking. The sprite is cool. And how it works is cool. That shit, like, reminds me of something out of Doom. That looks like some hellish fucking pentagram. Hey, ancient foliage. Foliage. You know what I'm saying? Planetary blade. Ooh, I like that. The first boss you find beyond for the gun beyond the forgotten ages can, you know, help you craft stuff against the final boss in Terraria. That's pretty cool. Summon tax. That might, that's gonna be useful for Larkus if we have that mod during Larkus. I don't know. We might get G round back instead of Beyond the Forgotten Ages. That, or we might get a completely different mod. I do have some mods in mind, but let's just sell all this. You're Timmy, and I ain't talking about Turner. You ain't the cool one. You're just Timmy. Timmy the fucking fisherman. Alright, we're gonna craft one more item in this episode. And it's called the metronome. It's very interesting how it works. It's bad and good. Every three seconds, the metronome will flip between tick and tock. Tick increases your symph symphonic plane speed and damage. Tock decreases your symphonic plane speed and damage. So it's very interesting how it works. Three second timer. I don't make three second timers. I need like watches. Like the best watch we can get. Watch. Pocket. Okay, well, no, I feel like it would come up even if I typed in watch. Watcher, Obsidian Watcher. Ooh, spooky. Future 1.3.6 enemy news spoiler alert. Yellow circle, red arrow in the thumbnail. I'm sorry. Uh, watch. Yeah, they are called watches. Maybe I just don't have the materials for it. No, I need a table and a fucking chair. I don't have a chair. Give me a chair. Just any, any chair cactus there we go now we should be able to make it yeah there we go there's that and then we like just put that back in there there's that and then now can we make a timer we make a one second timer what do i need for the, the bigger timer three second wait what the fuck Wait, one second is a good one. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Whatever. We'll, we can use that in the future. Tungsten. We need a tungsten watch then. So let's get more tungsten. I don't think we need more tungsten. No, I think we need more uh, chains. That's what we need. No, nope, we got more than enough chains. Watch. Oh, shit. We were, able to, we were able to make a tungsten one. All right. Now we can make the timer. Boom. There it is. Three second timer. So we take that, and then let's check if we have arcane dust in here. We got three. We're going to need more than that. Dust. Ooh, I don't have uh, I don't have more fallen stars in there. Now we can make it dust. Make a good bit. I'm feeling like that should be a good bit for the future. And now we can type in the uh, metronome. There it is. So let's see how this let's see how this fully works. It's on tick. It's on talk. It's on tick. It's on talk. 
So let's see how much our damage goes up. 22, 26, 37, 31, 19, 22, 38, 32, 23, 27. Okay. And then this one, 45, 38. Dude, this thing fucking hits hard. I just can't find good uses for it. This might be a good use right here. You just gotta like... You just gotta get, find like the right angles and shit. Like, I don't feel like doing geometry in my head. I don't feel like doing math in my head. Dude, the carpet is so cool, but like, honestly, there's no use for it. I want to use it so badly. Hey, we might give that to my boy David. David does need a carpet. So we might have to swing. Let's swing by the boy David right now. No, there's nowhere I can put it. No, there is somewhere I can put it. Because my boy David is going to need a carpet. No, I'm pretty sure I crafted one. I don't know. Fuck it. We're going to end this episode off. Tell me, guys, what you think about the metronome. Next episode, we'll be fighting. Fuck. Next episode, we'll be fighting Granite Energy Storm, Buried Champion. We're going to be trying to get all the granite stuff, all the weapons and stuff we can get from those two. So I'll see y'all next time.